So what's up guys, so welcome back again, this is Naya Boy Adams Link, how you guys doing, welcome to another video, and uh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from, I hope you guys are very much doing okay. So let's discuss about Omali. You know, it's usually really good eh, to see so many artists going out there to perform abroad, and uh, whenever you see them performing, you see you, they, they bring some ladies upstage to dance with them, to just do normal stuff with them not normal but sometimes it can be really really ridiculous so amali while performing in switzerland recently this guy decided to wear bra because a lady threw a bra on stage and amali knew what i'm not just gonna throw this bra back or keep it somewhere i'm gonna wear it to perform that also we boost his fans LGBTQ community might see that as a gesture, might see that as a way of promoting LGBTQ, and that will also boost his fan base. No, well, whatever reason he, he thought about doing that thing, I hope it's good for him. And again, you s there are some videos I can't post here because of uh, YouTube rules and regulation. You know, we are limited, so. And again, why dancing with uh, some uh, fans? Why dancing with some fans? It was so rigorous. And I just want to give advice. If you remember years ago, Akon was on stage. They almost blackmailed. Akon almost ran into a huge problem because of uh, dancing with uh, fans on stage. There, there, there's, there's a reason why some artists do no longer want to dance with fans on stage because they might be used against an artist you might accidentally bring up a 15 years old or 16 years old underage girl to dance with on stage unknowingly and you might go you might go uh, you might uh, find yourself in really really deep trouble well it's all good though you are performing and everything they are supposed to bring their own id card and security are supposed to check as uh, security is supposed to check them to know if they are up to age before going to into that venue but sometimes they might make mistakes just like what happened to Econ. Econ had to make a video to apologize because of the way he danced humanely to him on stage with an underage uh, uh, girl now Mali was wearing a bra and enjoying himself my general advice to all that to nigeria artists is that you know we are getting this international recognition and with all those recognition there are some bad things that usually follow it's not as if all those rappers are really happy or our ambassadors abroad are happy with the way that we are gaining this international recognition they are not happy honestly we are taking their market away from them they are taking their market away from them so they are not happy so they might just decide to be setting up afro beats up please I'm, I'm saying this now because i you know what whatever whatever that is good they always come with negativity always come with trials so i think they should be extremely really really careful even with the way they invite girls into the hotel room they should be extremely really 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 careful because they might be setting them up they might be setting them up afrobeat is taking over and honestly they are not happy they are not happy they might show that they are happy but they are not and they might be setting you guys up so please be extra careful don't be carried away with the money with the fans with the love that you are getting don't forget social media they can uh, use use them to work against you just like this and again bono boy has sold out a 9500 capacity in usa yesterday in uh, auckland yesterday here and nobody even heard about it he saw that venue out performed unlike before remember now we are we were still here on Adam's link now. Whenever we hear about any artist in Nigeria selling out a venue like 10,000 capacity, 50,000 capacity, it's like, whoa, like we, we go crazy. Right now, it's just like normal thing for 
three major artists in Nigeria. Just normal, they can just do that and nobody will even hear it. So generally all I'm saying that they should be extremely careful, you know. All those things are sweet. They can there is 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 all fun now, but they should be extremely careful. Let them just perform. And if they want to, I believe if they want to carry girls, allow your if you like a girl, just okay. I love that girl. Just send some of somebody from your camp to check out that girl. To check our ID card, go through your lawyer. You know that that there are paper. Uh, they do give fans to sign whenever they want to chill out with the uh, artist. They will give the paper to sign. You don't carry your phone. You sign paper that you won't disclose whatever that we go that we happen in the after party or inside the secret room. You should disc disclose it. And if you want to be paid as well, you will indicate the money that you want to be paid. And if it's for free, you will also indicate it as well. So that is the best thing to do now. Don't don't fall victims, guys. Don't fall victims. No, alphabet is going wide. Then, guys, we are coming over to Ninja. Check out this uh, video of twin sisters in Nigeria who recently cried out. According to them, their parents are trying to use them for money ritual. Okay. Good evening, Nigerians. My name is Fotadi Adibala Esther, and this is my sister, Fotadi Abimbala Esther. We are graduates of Federal University Agricultural Bekta. I finished from the Department of Hospitality and Tourism. My sister finished from the Department of Physics. Nigerians, we need your help. We are stranded. Our father is trying to kill us. Our mother is trying to kill us. They are trying to use us for ritual. We are able to escape. Nigerians, we need your help. Nigerians, please stand and fight for us, please. We need your help. We need all the bloggers. We need all Instagram influ influencers, please. We need your help, please. We are not safe. We are hiding. Please, we need your help. Nigerians, we need your help. Please share this video. Please like, like this video. Please post this video. Please, we need your help. We are in great danger. Our life is in great danger. They are trying to kill us. Us. Please like our video, please. Oh, sorry. Please share our videos. Please, bloggers, Instagrammers. Please, this is we are hiding. Please like our videos. Please share our videos. Please share our videos. Please, share our videos. please like our videos. Please, it's not safe for us out here. They are trying to kill us. Please, Instagram. Please, please. His name is. Fawotade. Fawotade Joseph his name Sunday. is Fawotade Joseph Sunday. His my mother's name, his wife's name is Fawotade Pamela. Fawotade Pamela. Please, Nigerians, we need your help. Please come to our rescue. The evil family is involved. Her father. This is this is really really serious. Really really serious. Someone posted at that picture. I don't know if this is real. Their father picture. Say so here is their dad. Please help. These girls are not one to pull stunts. Anybody that knows them can attain to the fact that they are calm and easy going. Please help them. Please help them. They are in Lagos. Please retweet in Nigeria police. See this. Check the trend. This is extremely serious. Well, thank God they are both graduates and they can just pick up their life. They can be employed and they can pick up their life. They speak fluently. You check the girl. Wow. They should go. Man, I don't want. <laughs> Same parents that trade them through university. Same parents that train them through university want to kill them. I don't, well, okay, you know what? Before I start blasting the parents, eh, I think they need to get to the bottom of this. And thank God they can fight for themselves. They are graduates. Thank God for that. Wow. This story is so hard for me to believe. I know there are, there are ritualism there, I know, but okay, I hope they get the help that they need and uh, of course they said televise it and i'll be able to do do my own part i hope uh, the nigeria police immediately 
help them out to check out what is going on please now, wow crazy mm. people are wicked guys people are extremely 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 wicked but thank you guys for watching the boy Adams link and uh, have a wonderful day stay blessed catch you next time peace